Welcome to Sport Eagle TV post game from the Audi Dome. FC Bayern basketball defeat the Telecom Baskets Bonn 104 to 91. With me to break down the action is head coach from Bonn, Michael Koch. Uh, coach, uh, it was a close game in the first half, the first 20 minutes, back and forth between the two. The deciding factor, the deciding phase had to be the beginning of the second half. What did Bayern bring to your club and how were you not able to handle it? First of all, the first one or two minutes, I think we were we were in the game. We were ready to play. We had uh, a little bit more building the lead, four four point lead, and then uh, suddenly we didn't play uh, good enough defense. We gave up uh, too many open looks for Bayern Munich. They made four or five three point shots in a row. And uh, when you play on the road, and then the crowd gets involved, and the players feel confident, and so the Bayern Munich had uh, a great run. They were confident, and we were a little bit in a hole, and it needed some time for us to gather ourselves and, and come back into the game. Uh, finally, after, after five minutes, we were down only 10 points. After the end of the quarter, we were in the game, so we, we fought our way back into it. But a tough team like Munich, and then when you're down 15, 16 points uh, once in a game, it's tough to come back. It's been a struggle for both teams starting out this season, uh, but now your club, your five and six playoff team from a year ago, what needs to change? You have, first of all, you have to give your, uh, your club credit. They did fight at the end. But what has to change so that you don't allow a team like Munich on the road to, to beat you guys? Yeah, name of the game is defense. Very simple. Uh, I think when you play on the road and you get more than 100 points, uh, you have a little bit problems on defense. Uh, we scored 93, uh, I think, or 90 points. It's enough to win on the road. And this is uh, the point we have to work on. Lately, we had a couple of games where we let the opponent score too many points. So we try to switch a little bit defenses, uh, pressing, zone presses, go into zone, just to mix it up a little bit. Uh, this team is, is built uh, to be a team that likes to play offense and move the ball and play European basketball. Uh, in the league in Germany, it's a lot individual, a lot of guards who can really penetrate, and this is a little bit our problem, to keep the guys in front. So we have to still work on defense a little bit more, and especially changing defenses. With me, standing between two giants here, Robin Benzing and Jan Jagle. Robin Benzing, the leading scorer in the game, 21 points, and Jan Jagle with 17 points and 6 rebounds. Let's first talk to Robin. Uh, I tweeted that you probably ate your Wheaties this morning. What happened today at the beginning of the game that you... Did you have your touch? Uh, I was just motivated. I practiced a lot in the week, and um, you know, I just took the shots, and they went in. It felt good, and then you get a rhythm, and it's easy. And then, uh, in the deciding phase of the game, uh, in the beginning of the third quarter, Jan, you came in and you started raining threes from all over the place. D did you get the feeling from the team? What was going on today? No, I mean, I don't know. The first one went in, and then, you know, you take the second one, it's halfway open, and then when you make two in a row, you know, you kind of start feeling it. So, um, yeah, I mean, some days, you know, the ball just starts starts going in. Now, I'm sure Coach is probably more happier, more than just the three-pointers being made, but he mentioned rebounds. You guys out -re rebounded uh, Bond today. Did you guys also work on that over the week, uh, Robin? Of course, uh, we lost the rebound battle um, extremely high in, in Berlin, and you know I was disappointed. And that's why we work a lot on this, and it fits. Kyle, 15 points today, but you guys lost. I'm sure you would have rather have a win coming out today. For sure, uh, it's not about individuals with me. Uh, never has been, but just uh, would have been nice to get a win here. We haven't won here in a while, and uh, not a good showing last year. But um, you know, just to get above 500 today would have been nice. But we fell short. It was quite tight the first half. You guys were back and forth, lead, uh, lead uh, changes and ties. What happened there at the beginning of the uh, second half, beginning of the third quarter where Byron went on the run? What happened to you guys? Uh, we just let them hit some shots. Um, you know, they missed some shots that they usually make in the first half as well as we did. Um, and they came out focused and determined uh, to take over that lead. And, and we let them get their head up and get their confidence going. And you got to give, you know, Munich credit for that. Um, they came out ready to play that second half. And uh, we let them hit some, you know, some key threes. And uh, those were kind of some daggers. You guys are traveling now for your next game in uh, Tiflis. Talk about your, your guys' mindset for this. Because as Coach said, you win this, you get through. Well, like you said, we win, we get through. Like Coach said, we win we get through and that's just our mindset right now I mean it was a tough loss today but we got to have um, you know a short memory and uh, just kind of forget about it put it in our back pocket and we can think about it next week before we uh, you know per prepare for Würzburg but as of right now you know we need, we need to be tiflis to advance in the second round of Euro Challenge and that's on our mind